Nina Warhurst shared photographs of her blossoming baby bump as she announced the happy news. The presenter told her followers that she is due in the summer and that the first few months of her pregnancy had been funky. She wrote in the caption, Happy Mother's Day to all of those who are any part of this endless handover of love, values, genes, chaos and perpetually crumb-infested kitchens. I'd like to say you got this mama. But maybe you haven't. I dunno. It's hard isn't it? That said we are doing it again. It's been a funky few months. Involving intense migraines, vomiting, morning kebabs, first time acne, small acts of violence against fruit, afternoon kebabs, tears, spontaneous snoozes, anxiety and more kebabs. I am settling into the middle chunk, emphasis on chunk, and enjoying the wonders of Mother Nature and her tiny kicks and flutters. Nina and her husband had already shared two sons, Digby and Michael, who were born in 2016 and 2018. Continuing her post, the popular presenter said her boys are looking forward to the new arrival. She wrote, the boys and the cat have been enjoying their new chair. God willing, baby Donair Shish joins the outside world in the summer. Nina concluded that she is blown away that we do this while also being acutely aware of the privilege, born of nothing but fortune. She signed off, sending love to those who've had to say goodbye to the babies they lost and the ones they dreamed of. Nina was inundated with congratulatory messages from hundreds of her fans, with many saying they had already worked out her happy news. Tony said, had been telling the wife for weeks that you were pregnant. Well now it's official and huge congratulations to you and your family on the bump. Don't miss. Denise Van Outen opens up about strange relationship with ex-husband. Insight, Elton John joins growing list of celebs to snub Harry and Meghan, news, neighbours actor Peter Hardy found dead on Australian beach aged 66, latest, Andrew echoed, I knew you were pregnant weeks ago congratulations. Yvonne gushed, you have been trying to hide it but I thought you were. Congratulations. And Eugene penned. Thought we had you sussed a few weeks ago but my dear missus thought it might just be down to a bad dress from Salford's wardrobe department, kind soul that she is.